Ja doch, das Passwort geschützt oder nicht? No shit, it needs a password. How about step douche? Try again. I need more clues. Hmm, ich mir Nothing to see here. Maybe I could try stepdad for the password. Happy Sweet 18. Chloe, ich bin so froh, dass du heute geboren wurdest. Danke, dass ich mich zu deiner Familie zählen darf. Von Herzen, dein Stiefvater. Wie wär's denn mit Chloe als... Grüße. Aus der Katie Bay als Passwort. Nope. Ich glaube, ja, Chloe ist, ist das Passwort, wenn überhaupt. Nothing in it. Naturally, David would buy a heavy-duty military padlock. I can even see the combination. That might be a useful password. Sieben eins, sieben eins. Probieren wir's. Try again. No way, Max. You totally froze the laptop. Macht nichts. Ich kann erstmal nach Hinweisen suchen. Äh, kann ich das vorschlagen? There's no way Chloe can put that gun back now. Hm. Huh. Maybe this ID number might work. I could try the license number for the password. Lizenzen tragen verdeckte Waffen. Mhm. Looks like David has read this a lot. What did he learn? Obviously, David's parents care about him. That date might be a good password. Cute. Can't picture David driving Joyce around with this on the car. Hoped for sure, okay. I still need to find the password to David's computer. That's cute. Could be a password here. To a real hero. Mm -hmm. Even David Madsen might be an angel to somebody else. I'm in Ingram Kampf für die Flügelstein. Okay. Now the car looks ready to roll. This is a better hobby for David than surveillance. Joyce might as well have wrote "Let's get married." That might be a useful password. Sie haben eine Ehre, sie im Dinner zu haben. Es ist schön zu wissen, dass es noch ein Gentleman gibt. Ich hoffe bald wieder mit Ihnen reden zu können. Nebenbei, mein Name ist Joyce. Falls Sie es vergessen haben sollten, du wählst eine Rechnung. Eierwürstchen. Aha, aha. Wir suchen ganz bald wieder ihre Bedienung Joyce. David has been dragging this head around since 2001. Okay. 
So, die Armee ist ziemlich wichtig. Halt die Flügel steif. Aufklärungseinheit. Ah, Shitballs. Such wrong. No way, Max. You totally froze the laptop. Worst hacker ever. Um. Magic Eight Ball says no. No way, Max. You ich totally froze weiß. the laptop. Ich hab den Laptop äh, einfrieren lassen, schon klar. So. Familie. Äh. Starting. Nope. Dieses Datum. Score! Max the Hacker strikes again. Whoa, spoiler alert. Rachel definitely hooked up with Frank. But why does David care? Profil von Rachel Ember. Rachel schwänzt die ganze Woche von ihrem Unterricht. Frank und Rachel treffen sich erneut. Rachel meidet das Wohnheim. Folgte Rachel zum Leuchtturm. Zum Leuchtturm. Vielleicht ist sie im Leuchtturm. Das könnte ich mir durchaus vorstellen. Dass der Leuchtturm der Ort ist, wo sie gefangen ist. Seit Ewigkeiten. Bericht der Arcadia Bay Polizei, Fall Nummer 678. Bericht in der... Beamter Anderson Berry. Schilderung des Vorfalls. Rachel Amber 18 wurde um 14.35 Uhr an der Blackwell Akademie wegen des Besitzes von Rauschgift aufgegriffen. Dies wurde vom Sicherheitsschiff David Madsen gemeldet, der sie bei dem Versuch beobachtete, einen verdächtigen Medikamenten oder Koffer zu verstecken oder zu sichern. Der Beamte wurde gerufen, Miss Amber zu befragen, die mit Drohungen und Verleugnungen Verleugnen reagierte. In ihrem Koffer wurden mehrere illegale Substanzen gefunden. Sie anhang für die detaillierte Übersicht. Instead of stalking Kate, David could have helped her. Kate M. geht den gleichen Weg zu jedem Unterricht. Hörte Kate und Dana über Besorgungen für die Vortex Party reden. Drogen? Kate mit ihrer Kirchengruppe beobachtet. Sie kennt die Bibel gut. Kate braucht länger im Bad als alle anderen. Drogen? Sah Kate Jefferson nach dem Unterricht helfen. Äh, traue niemals Erwachsene mit Spitzbart. Ach du Scheiße, was hast du denn für eine Einstellung? Äh, Kate hält sich seit der Vortex-Party von anderen fern, selbst von der Kirche. Drogen? Wieso denkt er jedes Mal, dass es sofort wegen Drogen ist? Es ist wegen dem Video. Voll Idiot. Versuchte mit Kate über die Party zu reden. Sie verärgerten Flo schuldig. Oh Mann. This is so wrong. Oh, creepy bastard. Profil von Max Caulfield. Pseudonym im Internet Mad Max. Max Factor Noah Angel. Maxine Caulfield Schülerin. Aha. Max Stundenplan Oktober. St okay. I better tell Chloe about this now. Whoa, spoiler alert. Rachel du definitely wieder, hooked up with Frank. Kannst du runterfahren, Mann? Das ist dumm, das ist jetzt, uh, why does David geknackt, care? Geknackt lässt. Taylor. Hey Max, wollte nur Danke sagen, dass du für mich und meine Mutter interessierst. Du hast dich für Kate eingesetzt. Als sonst niemand tat. Danke, Taylor. Ich weiß, du hast ein gutes Herz. Nicht gut genug, um sie zu retten. Aber ich bin hier, wenn du wen zum Reden brauchst. Das bedeutet mir viel. Bis bald, x -Core. Okay. Nice breakfast. David, you, you back already? I have to take a nap after writing up vandalism reports last night. What happened? Some little shit-ass punks broke into the swimming pool. This is what happens at these PC bullshit colleges. Entitled students taking over the campus. Do you know for sure it was Blackwell students? Who else would do it? And I'm gonna bust them. <sighs> oh, 
figures you'd be here. Is that your Rachel Amber Halloween costume? You know more about her than me. No, you and Chloe think you know more than anybody, like all teenagers. Leave Max alone, David. Stop threatening students. He threatens them with surveillance cameras so he can spy on everybody, like he spies on all of us here. Don't start, Chloe. Not now. Yeah, I'm just always starting shit, right? You're a total paranoid, David. Not now, Chloe. You used to call me a loser for getting kicked out of Blackwell. So who's the loser now, David? Who haven't you accused or harassed? Between your investigations into Rachel and Kate, what have you done besides get in trouble? You're a bully, David. I saw you harass Kate Marsh when she was going through hell. You could have totally helped her. Everybody at Blackwell is a suspect to you, except for Nathan Prescott. That's why the students and faculty don't like you. You even hit your stepdaughter. I do respect your service, but you don't respect anybody. Chloe was doing drugs. That's illegal. So is spying on people in your family and at your work. Why do you have photos of Kate Marsh and Rachel Amber in your files anyway? What? Is this true, Max? Yes, David, why do you have these files at all? I find this very disturbing. I do not have to take this kind of interrogation. Not from you punks. Maybe you should calm down. Oh, you're turning on me now, huh? Of course, women always stick together. Well, screw you. David, you better go to a hotel until we figure this out. You can't kick me out of my own home. It's my home, David, paid for and in my name. You know the law, right? Oh, I, I thought I knew a lot of things. Like when I'm outflanked. Have a nice day. Chloe, for once, just please shut up. I hope Joyce doesn't hate me for tearing into David. Max, don't beat yourself up. David earned this all by himself. Understand? Mm -hmm. Max, that gave me chills. And you better not rewind this one. Thank you very much. That's what you're saying. Uh-huh. Listen, when I went through David's laptop, I found pictures of Rachel and Frank being more than friends. <laughs> right, no way, Max. She was just posing to tease Frank. If you're not gonna believe me, why don't we check out what Frank has in his RV? What's that gonna prove? Frank has Rachel's bracelet. What else does he have in there? Motherfucker better not have anything, for his sake. Let's check the door. Frank gets so wasted, he sometimes forgets to lock it. I can't believe you hung out with him. Not anymore. We have to be casual ninjas here. Shipples. Okay, here's the plan. I'll go to the diner and distract Frank by telling him I have his money, but he needs to come with me. Then you come in and rewind so Frank doesn't see me. Then you can tell Frank he needs to check out his RV, and then you rewind after you get the key, and, uh, and... Chloe, I got this. I'll be right back. Don't let my epic plan get in the way of yours. I'll try to scrounge up a Scooby snack to distract his mangy mutt. Now to find a quick and easy way to snag Frank's keys. Okay. Das, äh, Maxine, Papa hier, verzeih, dass ich mich nicht eher gemeldet habe. Ich weiß, du bist traurig, aber deine Mutter und ich will wissen, dass du alles in deiner Macht Stehende getan hast. Manche Dinge liegen einfach nicht in deiner Hand. Wenn du zum Relaxen nach Hause kommen und hier auf eine Schule gehen möchtest, steht die Tür immer weit offen. Kuss, Papa. Danke, Papa. Es war hart hier. Ich bin noch nicht so weit, nach Hause zu kommen. Bis später. Max. Max sagt so. Äh. Da war noch eine SMS. Guten Morgen. Okay. Freut mich zu sehen, dass du nicht, äh, dass du Blackwell nicht gesprengt hast. Na gut, freut mich fast. 
Nebenbei, das Autokino ist schwer beliebt, also kaufe ich die Tickets jetzt. Du bist für das Popcorn verantwortlich, also gibt es kein Zurück mehr. Okay. Careful, Max. Kujo ahead. Locked. I hope she finds a nice T-bone to keep the doggy busy. Apropos Doggy, wo ist der eigentlich? Hier ist noch ein Vogel. Der ist auch tot. What is going on here? Okay, langsam glaube ich nicht, dass es äh, daran liegt, dass die... Äh, dass es mit dem Haus zu tun hat, sondern dass es tatsächlich die, die ganzen sterbenden Vögel anhand einer wirklichen Naturkatastrophe kommen. Tornados, Snowfall, Eclipses? Now dying animals? Holy shit. Na gut, wurde ja auch in diesem einen komischen Dingens Zeitungsausschnitt oder sowas gemacht. This is so creepy. Look at all these flyers. It's so sad that nobody will read them. Good morning. How are the fish today? Don't ask. First the snow, then an eclipse. What's next? The tornado? You don't think it could be like climate change or something? Climate sure has changed around here. Just saw that Prescott brat having a fit by himself in the parking lot. Isn't he always having a fit? He ain't the only one. If you knew what was going on with the fish around Arcadia Bay. Sorry, I'm too pissed to talk about it. See you around, kid. Mm -hmm. Good morning. How are Don't ask. Die Fische. I heard that something bad was happening to the fish in Arcadia Bay. Well, since you mentioned it first, there ain't no fish in Arcadia Bay. <laughs> What? Come on. None? None worth catching and eating anymore. I'm not shitting you. Salmon, trout, bass have died and migrated. Even the damn clams are dying. Oh my god. But what about... Sorry, it's too salty to talk about it. See you around, kid. Hmm. Noch ein toter Vogel. Tornadoes, snowfall, eclipses. Now dying animals. That would be cool to be a trucker for a while. Hey, how's it going? Peachy. Interview over. Worst interview ever. Work is dried up around here, and I have bills to pay. Time is money to a guy like me. That sucks. Wish I could drive right out of goddamn Arcadia Bay. The whole town is crumbling. Snow, eclipse, that slut suicide. Listen, Kate Marsh was not a slut. She was severely depressed for good reasons. You didn't even know her, did you? I know all these Blackwell spoiled shit, like that other loser I'd see around here, Rachel. You knew Rachel Amber? Can you tell me about her? Nope. Christ, why don't you get a real job instead of homework? I'd love to see you Blackwell turds try to drive my 1977 Needham 18 wheeler out there. Like I said, interview over. Mm-hmm. Guck mal, ich weiß was über dein Auto. Hey, how's it? Peachy. In Actually, I wanted to ask if that's your bitch in 1977 Needham 18 wheeler out there. How the hell did you know that? My friend Rachel Amber told me about this cool rig in town because I love taking pictures of truckers. You knew Rachel. She sure didn't give a rat's ass about truckers. Or real work. Oh, so you must have known her too? Only from the diner. She was just a gold digger. She belonged in California with all those you know who know what's. Good riddance. But you can take pictures of my truck anytime. Take care. Let's talk about my photo shoot later. Ten four. Ich komme hier nicht über die Straße, also kann ich den Truck auch nicht gut betrachten. 
Yes, another great day in Arcadia Bay. Ja, das hatten wir schon. Okay. Die allwissende Pinner Pinnerin da. Mal gucken, was sie diesmal zu sagen hat. I hate seeing old women on the street like that. Hi, how are you? I remember you. I heard about that girl killing herself at Blackwell. Mm, awful thing. I think it's all connected to Rachel Amber's disappearance. A lot of things in Arcadia Bay are connected to Rachel. Including Nathan Prescott? That spoiled shit finally got kicked out of his daddy's school. He also drugged the girl who jumped. Sounds like you know a lot more than me, child. I just think Arcadia Bay is in trouble. Maybe you'd like to tell me what you're hiding. Okay. I feel like I can trust you as much as Chloe. And you wouldn't think I'm crazy. Too late for me to judge anybody. Plus, you're not crazy. I'm just gonna say this. I had a vision of Arcadia Bay being destroyed by a tornado. For real. Could be. Bad mojo is in the air this week. Thanks for the warning, Max. Thanks for that storm warning, Max. And, uh, I'll let you know if I find out anything. Ich finde die cool. Die ist tatsächlich eine von den Personen. Die ich als ziemlich intelligent einschätzen würde, auch dafür, dass er trotzdem eine Pinnerin ist. Look at that. So sad and disturbing and beautiful at once. What an amazing shot. So ominous. Gehen wir mal rein. Good Lord, Bacon. I'm ready to nosh again. Oh, but I need to get those keys from Frank. Okay, es ist jetzt offiziell ausverkauft, aber ich habe uns Tickets organisiert. Musste dafür ein paar Typen verscheuchen, verdammte Nerds. Okay. Nathan has time to get drugs from Frank because he was expelled. Can't drop any tunes right now. Keys. Looks tasty, but my need for keys comes first. Never mind me, officer. I'm just here to steal a drug dealer's keys. Maybe we all did. Okay. Shit. What are the other signs then? Äh, lass mal gucken. Die sieben Zeichen. Die See und der Himmel werden sich schwarz färben. Und die lebenden Dinge sterben. D äh, wegen deswegen okay das ist glaube ich ein Bibelvers von den äh, von der Apokalypse but that doesn't explain the recent extreme weather patterns no but we have to start with the hypothesis that climate change is a partial cause for the unseasonal weather that doesn't explain everything, of course. Frankly, we don't know yet. Dr. Hedora, 
Will your team know more after their latest tests? I hope we see more patterns, which gives us an atmospheric template. Many local residents of Arcadia Bay have been questioning what has been going on with this crazy weather. We had an eclipse yesterday, a snowstorm two days ago, which, as most of you know, is not common this time of year. It's unprecedented, to be honest with you. Uh, the last time that we had a snowstorm of this caliber was over 100 years ago. All of us are questioning what is happening in Arcadia Bay. Please feel free to call in and let me know what your experience has been, what you think this might be. Is this global warming? What is causing all of this crazy weather? Frank Bauer stars in A Face Full of Beans. You eat like a pig. Try the floor. I was eating those beans. Are you fucking insane? I was eating those beans! Ugh. <laughs> Das hat mir gefallen. Frank Bauer stars in A Face Full of... I could chug this beer or dump it on Frank. Beer is gross, so... I just wanted to see what would happen if I did this. I'm gonna kill you. Tja. <clears throat> Turn up the brain to 11, Max. How can you snag Frank's keys? You show up after almost shooting me? You have serious balls, little girl. But hanging out with Chloe, playing with guns and dressing like Rachel doesn't make you cool or tough. The fuck do you want? How do you know these are Rachel's clothes? Because she looks beautiful in them and you look like ass. Aiming a gun doesn't make you any sexier. Grab your keys and let's check out your RV. Let's not. You fucking creep me out. In other words, Max, no keys. Maybe I could chat up that officer, or even Nathan, and then go all Groundhog Day on them until I get the info I need. What the fuck now? Could I get you to drop Chloe's debt? Are you supposed to be a smart student? You'll find out if you do me this favor. Thanks, Godmother, but I don't need your favors. And Chloe doesn't get any from me. Okay. Nathan. Rachel! Uh, whatever the fuck. Uh. Oh, look. Max Amber. Nice outfit. <laughs> By the way, thanks for getting me fucking expelled, you twee bitch. You're lucky this is a public place. Considering we're in a public diner with a police officer right over there, you shouldn't advertise your rage, Prescott. Oh, yeah? You shouldn't have bitch snitched on me to that fucked up principal. I bet you hoped that Kate Marsh would stay quiet. Idiot says what? Did you drug her? You are so stupid, Max. You think you're so goddamn smart, too. Don't push me, girl. You don't want me for an enemy, understand? Do you? Calm down, dude. We're in the diner. Right. Plus, you're an adult now. I can sue your dumbass for libel. Thanks. Now fuck off, Dyke. Holy shit, what do you want now? <laughs> Listen, Nathan. I'll take back everything I said about you. If you hook me up with Frank. Know what I mean? You look like you've never even taken a hit of baby aspirin. How do you think I stay wired all night studying? So is it a deal or not? Calm down, hard up. Deal. You get your school supplies, just go over to Frank and whisper, higher education. You'll hook your ass up. Try interrogating somebody else, Lieutenant Caulfield. Okay. Holy shit, what do you want now? Mm. I bet Frank hooked you and Rachel Amber up with party supplies. Nice try. Rachel partied like a fiend on her own. More than me. I doubt that. Like you would know, virgin. Even that pig over there knows Rachel hung out more with Frank. 
I mean, don't talk to the cop about that, dumbass. Hmm. Holy shit. What? Your sugar daddy will always protect you and threaten me. You don't know shit about my father or me. Nobody here does. Then tell me what I should know. Why? So you can pretend to care, hmm? Spoiler alert, he's an asshole. Maybe I could help you. I don't need you for anything except to stay out of my fucking business, understand? Now get out of my face. Gut, ähm an der Stelle werde ich jetzt aber mal sagen, ich meine, ich habe noch die Möglichkeit, das eine ganze Menge zu machen, aber die Aufnahme ist jetzt schon lange genug und ich brauche ehrlich gesagt jetzt nicht viel mehr Zeit. Ich wollte das jetzt erstmal heute noch zu Ende kriegen. Ich habe heute noch was vor und deswegen werde ich an der Stelle die Aufnahme beenden, wenn ich jetzt halt was nachspielen muss, da wird es wieder auf den Stand kommt, dann mache ich das halt. Demzufolge sehen wir uns in der nächsten Aufnahme wieder, wenn ich mit dem Polizisten und Frank rede und die Informationen halt auch nochmal in den nächsten probieren. Also dann, bis zum nächsten Mal. Tschüss.